And welcome back again to the monotonous Draken Guard. Also the annoying Draken Guard sometimes. Uh, the last chamber is kind of hard to do in the Ooh, look at my magic now. Isn't that great? Time! I'm coming! Full of bloodlust as always. But you helped me. Once again. Who are you, anyway? Well, he's the silent protagonist, but he has a reason why. Kyle, you cannot speak. is no longer safe. I, I thought I would take Furiai to the elf village. Since the elves are bound to eternal neutrality, their village will be a safe haven from the Empire. While it may be dangerous to take the goddess from the castle, what else is there to do? Furiai is the goddess that protects the sacred seal. But before that, she was my betrothed. I will protect her. And what about you, Kyan? You once called Furia your sister. Does she speak? There's a lot of facial expressions down there. I mean, it's kind of interesting to see their facial expressions and dialogue, but it's also kind of weird. Yielding to Inor. Inuart, Kaim. You see, you can't pronounce everything as you would think. You have to pronounce every vowel and syllable. Kaim agrees to go with Furiai and Inuart to the elf village. Happy for the chance to travel with Furiai, Inuart sings a song. He'll just know that a false hope leads him. Of course, it's only a false hope. Yep, here we go. Here's a cutscene. Perhaps we should celebrate. Someone's gonna die. Well, I would think. The usual song? I don't know, because I said false hopes. So I was like, someone's dead. Okay, I'll save, <laughs> but it seemed kind of quick. Just a random song. <gasps> a map? New free expedition is available. Choose your destination. Well, see, that's the castle of the goddess. Well, obviously, we're going to be going to the Solid Forest. So we'll try and make our way to like the Elf Village. This is so medieval. Complications. I wasn't expecting any less in this game. On the trail to the neutral elf village, a small band and their escort of Union soldiers make camp. Then the dragon hears an ill-omened voice. So strange, a mix up between these weird... The ch camp and the forest. This is such an oddly structured game. Okay. Can I talk? Target. Okay. <laughs> Imagine cutting them down. I have to live, don't I? As the seal. Well, there she's talking. They're, they're a target, apparently. Well, okay. I guess he was the key to continue on. What is it? They attacked the village of the elves. It may already what? be gone. 
I heard a voice. It would be better to go elsewhere. Nonsense! The Pact Beast may have powers, but I believe only my own eyes. Come on! We're going to the village now! <sighs> Free eye. No, I... I'm well. No, you're not. It's not true. You carry the awful weight of the seal. We must find you a place to rest. Clouds of dark foreboding brood over the village of the elves. The sky above the neutral lands, Kayim encounters imperial forces amassed in preparation for assault. Uh, uh, uh. Looks like I'm gonna have to fight. Oh. Oh. A dragon makes a pact with a man. The old legends oh, are alive. God damn, I hate this. Yeah, but I don't want to do that, really. I have to fight these things. Uh, was what was the button again to do it? L1, R1 wasn't it? Oh, that's how you do it. Okay. I was getting confused with my buttons for a second. Hey, it's early in the morning. I should be allowed to get confused. I'm surprised I'm just awake already, personally. Except these things are like, what, bats? I mean, on a dragon, it's not like I have that much, you know. HP, you know. Not right now. Uh, where's that last guy? Well, I missed it completely. Or not, I don't know. That was more targets over there. Take a while to get there. Holy crap. Oh, not this thing again. I don't want to have to fight that again. But it looks like I will. As much as I hate it, it's going to have to happen. The cannons are hard to avoid, I find. Look at that. Buriai, without you, the goddess, the world shall surely perish. Ah, oh, damn you. Now that you are the goddess, my world is already dead. Try and aim with this dragon as a pain. Look, I'm already dead. Yeah, I lost a lot of uh, HP to try and fight this thing. This is the fight they only taught me to do that thing about. There we go. About, you know, turning around, like, later on. That would have helped me so much in the first part, even. And I'm so dead, though. There's no way around it. These guys have their shielding until a certain point in time. Whoa, jeez, so close. I guess so. Takes a while to kill these things, though. Because they have their shielding until a certain amount of time. You know, so it's like... I think it's also increasing the amount of enemies on screen, technically. There we go. Oh, great. I lost so much HP doing those battles alone. I can maybe somehow kill the side things first. 
That way I don't have to get too close to the cannons. That's how I see doing it right now. At least. See my cursor a bit. Looks like that's the key to killing it. Well, at least I thought it was. All I did was make it go lower. Now I gotta find out the other way to destroy it. I don't even know what I'm... I'm trying to find a way to destroy it. This seems imbalanced. What I can hope is that cannons are having a harder time trying to hurt me. Is it part of the same ship? It might be a double ship or something. Kai, serve your hatred to have you I don't know, I'm having trouble trying to figure out how to destroy this thing here. I thought maybe I destroyed the side parts, but I'm having trouble finding out where its main energy thing is on this. Alright, good, finally. My hope is that by, you know, getting rid of the side parts, you kind of imbalance it a bit. You know, making it hard for them to aim at you. I hope at least. Here, partial here too. There we go. I have to take a bit of my time on those parts. On these guys, take my time, it looks like. A bit better with the fact that I can now, like, you know, switch sides and stuff. I'm so dead here, though. These guys. Ah, oh, uh, they just shoot at you like this. <laughs> they just approached me. Oh, and you putting that around me? I'm, I'm dead. They're not. There's no recoveries for a dragon. What they can do is they can just approach you and like destroy you. So many of these things in the air. They're everywhere too. Like they're just everywhere. I can't even see the other way. And I know they're there. Which is stupid. Then I can't hit them now. But it's because I think it's to keep me at the big target. You know? Look how much energy I have left. It's virtually nothing. I took too many hits on that uh, first ship. This alone is going to cause me to take forever on these missions. The sky I, the, my dragon needs... Some better HP the dragon makes here. Pack with a man. The old legends have come alive. Try to avoid these things. It's pretty tough. I just have to keep moving around, I guess. You know, make sure not to stay stationary so that they can hit me. Because that would be the worst case scenario, I would think. See? They just kind of get behind you and then, like, you're, you're hit. I'm trying to find them is hard. There's like one left here. Go, I think. Yeah. Alright. Let's try to ship again. Each of these missions is going to be a part of alone at this rate. Mainly with the dying and all. At least I have a bit of a better idea of how to destroy this thing now. Just don't get too close to it. 
I understand the anatomy of it fits better. So to keep my distance is the smartest way I feel. And then destroy the sides. That way the cannons have less of a chance to hit you. Because they'll be a bit imbalanced, I think. And then I destroy the side part. Which will then help me to weaken it. Now I can kind of see it a bit better. Alright, so now... Furiae, without you, the goddess, the world shall surely perish. Alright, like I said, I'm trying Furia, to keep my distance. Now that you are the goddess, my world is already dead. Hmm. Alright then, let's aim at this thing here. If I can find my cursor again. Alright, let's uh, go back here. And then I'll turn around after. Try and aim at the uh, side portion. So, that kills the ship. Be missing. I think I know what I'm missing. At least I have a lot more energy this time, but I really have to take my patience here. I think I'm missing. The Empire has come here. All right. I think I have to aim at this portion. Yep. Okay. Oh, I hate these things too. while to be able to kill these things and then like try and get away from them you know you just too close to it holy crap I can't get away I want to get my distance but the dragon won't move that much ow Yeah, the dragon's not very maneuverable in these situations. No. Nope. I need to get my distance a bit from them to be able to even do anything. But right now they close the border so much that's hard. Alright. Where is he? Ah, oh, he's down there. Still got hit in the end. There we go. Now take care of this sh these ships again. Alright. Should be able to, in theory, do a little bit better here. In theory, I should. You know, again, maneuvering is a bit hard sometimes. There's only your hatred driving forward. Yep. Hatred of part of this game. You know, like trying to aim. Trying to dodge cannons and all that junk. I have a deep hatred of that at this game. Go backwards. Try and aim myself. Destroy whatever remains on that side, I think, because... Looks a bit too light. Having trouble though. Oh man, I gotta go back here again. My aiming sucked. Which is the problem. Alright, come on, aim man. I know you need to aim at something on this. Okay, what am I? What am I aiming at on this guy now? This guy still has. Oh, that down there. There we go. Ah, oh, damn! Cannon got me. 
I need to, uh... I think I need to imbalance them a bit more. No, I think only that side remains now. Back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. That's how it works here, it seems. Whoa, I clearly destroyed it just now. Now, can I use my magic in the air to destroy, like, the mass of those flying bird things, I wonder? Wouldn't that be great? Just, like, use the... Uh, I can. That seems to be helpful at least. I should have used that last time, I think. Ow, oh, cannons hurt. Ow, oh, cannons hurt. Cannons hurt badly. Hard to just hard to dodge when dodging bad things. For some reason, now my camera can turn around. Last time I couldn't. I wanted to kill these things first because they're the most annoying. And then take care of the thing here. Ow, oh, you see, they can just come out of nowhere and really decimate me here. I don't know how many more of these things remain, even. It would be great if I could kill them all soon. Unless they. I don't know, unless they, they're unlimited or something. I barely see anything here. I seem to have destroyed the ship, but I'm losing way too much of my energy still. Man, what the hell? Now they're like behind me. Where? If I can't see them, I can't hurt them. But they seem to always be out of my view. They always just seem to be right out of my view. There's still at least one more, I think. The Hell Village must be here. Target. It must be. Oh, I hope it is. I hope they let me save. I know I'm always saying that, but you have to admit it's true, right? Cool. Good. Now to the village. Hold on. You should probably listen to the dragon, though. We're gonna learn that probably. All right, save it. Hey, look, I can actually do a second mission. Yes, I see what happened. I pressed. No, I was, I was just pressing X, hoping to, you know, go faster. Oh, another one of these things. The elf village lies in the woods across the bridge. It must be there. Well, Creole. The least they are being moved toward the elf village. Kill the operators and halt the empire's advance. Uh, not this. They got they got those launcher things. That's not good. Not for me at least. All right. Well, at least I can do this to try and kill them on mass again. Where's my targets in here anyway? Right now, I just feel like I'm killing random schmoes. Ow. Ow. Damn. You can get launched off the dragon here. That's one problem. There's a target. Ow! That wasn't fair. I should get some leeway. I found one of my targets. Oh, there's so many of these guys right now. You can't really recover yourself here. Unless you can, but on occasion, maybe if you went on the ground. 
Ah, you stupid. Yeah, okay. Chest. Nice. Okay, so if I go on foot. Alright, let's make my way to the bridge then. Where is the bridge anyway? Huh, <laughs> in the opposite direction completely. Well, let's just build some of my magic then. Am I in the right direction now? Yes, I am. Hopefully, I don't have to slay them by foot. In this type of instance. There they are. Alright, let's just see what I can do here against all these targets. Wow, there's a lot of targets here. And it. I can just the Empire's forces have come even massacre here. them here. Is the village safe? That's what the dragon was telling you. It's not safe here. But nope, you didn't believe the dragon. How many more over here? What like is with you? Am I? A message! The elf village has been found to the east! Rotate elf village has been found. Hurry there now. Okay. I'm faster by dragon anyway. I cannot fly in this forest. Uh oh. You must go on foot. Alone. Okay then. I cannot dismount here apparently. Don't have to go back across the bridge. Well, let's at least clear the bridge for myself. I dismount over here. Well then, they forced me to use the dragon. There's a spear, but why would I use the spear when I got a sword? My comet dance. I have, oh my god. I need my axe. I definitely need an axe here. Oh, you stupid. Oh, you stupid. Stupid, I'm having trouble again. Oh, whatever. Come on. Just kill. Use your bloodlust. You know, your bloodlust. This guy's not dead yet? I thought he was. Man, I need to level up this axe. I think. Alright, good. Of course, they do me these heavy duty soldiers that sucks to they use. They cannot dare to come so far. Can they, Kain? Of course they could. Elves, you know. I'm pretty sure you can use them for stuff. Maybe. I don't know. Treasure box appeared, apparently. Where? Oh, back here. And here I got another weapon, I think. Which I can only see once I finish the mission. Like, I think if I do like a run and slash, I can actually take out some of the enemies a bit better. I'm not using my magic because I'm... Okay. This one you have to be a bit stingy with it. Because of the nature of it. There we go. Uh, I gotta go up this way now. But I miss it completely. These guys are heavily armored. Just get them in the corner and then whack on them. That's the strategy I've taken to liking. Right now, if I was to, like, hit a bunch of enemies, if I were to hit them, I could actually do some massive damage to them. Just build some speed, it seems, and then you can hit them. Alright, magic time, I think. There you go. See, that spell's pretty good, but... 
for these guys, that is, but once you lose it, now you have to rebuild it up, which takes forever. Get up comboing these dudes. Alright, he's dead now. I bet you the path ain't gonna be so simple. Okay, you see, you can do some good damage if you do a run and attack. I was able to kill like a good amount of soldiers with it. Now, that's the problem with the rock, it only hits right in front of you. So, if you miss them, that's uh, pretty bad. Got more of those guys. I don't want more of them. It's bad enough dealing with the ones I'm dealing with currently. If there was a way to put the camera behind you, at least a button, that would be good. But that doesn't seem to exist. Nope, that doesn't seem to exist. So basically, you gotta make a ran big ass turn around to even get the camera behind you. Not ideal at all. I'm getting hungry too. I haven't eaten this morning. Oh, and at least I got some of them with the rocks. Would the spear be any better with these guys or something? And I don't know it. Or what magic the spear has. It'd be great if I leveled it up though, because then the attack power would be greater, and then I could do more damage on them. Cool, recovery. Uh, I'm just still bashing them. Just mash the, the uh, square button. That's all you do in this game. All you do is mash the X. I mean the square. Usually you mash, mash X, not square, but this game is square. Right, I could probably change my controls a little bit, but I choose not to. Default. Alright. I couldn't get my thing. Kind. You and Freddy, I. Well, no. no matter. No, it does matter, I think. Because you know more about. I don't know much about these characters. I haven't learned anything about them. At least I don't feel I have. Ah, jeez, one axe guy gets you, and then, like, that's it. That's why I'm using my own axe. Again, yeah, because just do this. Huh, that was strange. But I, I, that was something I believe I read about. It's just I didn't know how to do it at the time. He's still alive. This way. Oh no, they're also behind me. No, oh, I'm running. I got kind of one down. My body is no longer mine alone. Can anyone? Can Kaim? Kaim, that's how you say it. I want to say came, but that's obviously wrong. Like I guess I have to pronounce everything weird here. It'd be great items on occasion, you know? Because, like, now you're just bombarding me with enemies here. It's kind of a nuisance. Look at this. Now I'm going to get those guys on me. I got to keep my distance from them. Ow. It is a good way to level up at the same time, but and yet it's also annoying to have to keep fighting these things. Because look at this. Just get, one gets behind you, and then that's it. There's nothing you can do about it. It just hits you. Yeah, I like the axe just because of the fact that they launch all the enemies. But, you know, I don't, know. I don't have really much to say. It's all complaints right now about this game. Hopefully it's, you know, warranted though. 
Uh, this is actually... Oh! Go down here. I have to go down this area. Sorry, my ear. So excuse these parts being a bit shorter, because like I said, you know, the missions are just kind of like... You know, weird. I find at least. Because they take forever sometimes. And then, like, by the time it's over, it's like, if I start a new one, it's just gonna take me forever again. So I might as well just stop the mission. Or not stop the mission, but I might as well, like, you know, just stop the party. No! Stop coming towards me! I don't want more than the. Oh, oh god, no. That's a problem I'm having, too, is that the enemies can just gang up on you like that. Getting close, so that's nice, but hmm, see, that's a nice move. I don't really know how to do it, though. God, they're doing that thing again where they're just coming from behind. Give me a target for sure. No, I think there's more. Oh god, no! There's too many. Get away from me! I hope they go back. Oh look, a recovery. I need it. Way too many of these guys right now. Mind. We can go forward or go back as you wish. Okay, let's go back. The problem is, what happens is like. You move up a little bit just to kill these guys, and then more enemies manage to come in through their, your, your sights. And then they just build onto what you're already trying to fight. And then they give you like one recovery every once in a while, and then you just lose it anyway. You know? It's great to lose my recovery, I love it. And then I'm afraid I'm gonna have to fight coming up here. At least kill a few more of them, man down to the last like three. Oh man there's more over there it's like once they hit your sights they just come towards you I think it's happening again all right good the targets over here oh it looks like it's the end of the level. It cannot be. I see it with my own eyes, and yet, it cannot be. Well, it be, man. Number four. Dragon status. And nothing for my axe. Well, actually, no, I don't know that yet. You obtained the weapon Tyrant's Hammer. The magic attack is a handful of lightning. Okay, we are going to equip you to an empty slot. Oh, it's too early, and yet... It's like, I know whatever happens next. Unless we get, like, a cutscene of some sort. Then that would be good. A fi at least a five-minute cutscene. Kaim and his party arrive at the Elf Village. But the Empire has been there first, and about them is the aftermath of its unlawful invasion. In Inuar despairs as he lays eyes upon the wasted ruins. Then Kayam and the dragon hear a voice. Ah, oh, more fighting. The elf village is close. Close, yet will I be able to even grab above head? Well, at least my sword feels a little bit faster, but at the same time, I feel like I'm taking more damage than I should be. Oh, what? They're shooting at me too? That's not fair. Oh god, how can I even defend against that? All they do is shoot at me from a distance. You 
can't defend against that. Now I'm just a sitting duck. Where are these guys? The village is here. Is it? I'm just gonna lay waste to all these things and progress as far as I can, I guess. Uh, there's no map. What does it say? That one's just close. Keep going. This wasted place. Hell. Hell has come here. Ugh. What shall I do? Ugh. The Hierarch Verdenay. I hear his voice. His voice? The Hierarch has a pack beast too? Yes, a dragon. A petrified dragon. Where is he now? He is at the temple in the desert. He wants you to go to him for your own safety. Oh, Furiai. You must forgive me. I'm not strong enough to protect you. But your songs... They call me. Songs? I... I pray for strength. Will you come? I've got no choice. We must investigate further. Go with Buddy Eye and protect her. We shall follow. The voice is that of the Hired Verdelay, the spiritual leader of the Union and guardian of the Four Seals. Seal of the Temple, the Seal of the Desert, the Seal of the Forest, and the Seal of the Goddess herself. Seeing Furii and Inuart go go to join Verdele, Kayim searches the village. There beside an Imperial soldier's body is a message written in blood. A soldier's body. I don't see a soldier's body. It's a soldier. That's the only soldier I see, I think. But again, it's overhead, so it's like, uh... Yeah. Can't really see around me. Heh, <laughs> I'm inside. I don't know why that was funny. This soldier's body. Message written in blood. Question. It's like a riddle. They're out the watchers. That's all I know. Target here. What, an elf woman. In the valley, the cult of the watchers has a shrine. They took everyone there. The Watchers again. What are they? At this point, who knows what they are. A dying elf tells Kayim about the shrine of the Cult of the Watchers, and Kayim begins to suspect that some evil bond connects the Cult and the Empire. Kayim flies to the shrine to rescue the elves and to learn more about the cult of the Watchers. Now this would be a perfect place for a save. So 
tells them they're not going to give it because I'm pretty much done now. Call the watcher strike. Yelled, scarred the temples. Uh, what I'd have to do then is. I'm not ready to do another flying mission though, so let's uh, quit quickly and see what a save brings me. Granted, it's I think I can continue scenes. So we go to story, let's say. Where are we at? Last word. Yeah, you see the hidden, sh hidden shrine aerial mission. That's where I'm currently at. So there are some good things to this game sometimes. I can continue if if I do progress past a certain point. It looks like I don't have to save. It'll just you know, uh, you know, it'll t certain scenes will like bypass, so I don't have to save it. It seems like it'll let me continue the event or past the event I've already been to. So in the way the events sort of work as saves as well. Well, anyways, like I said, I don't want to continue anymore. It's been a bit longer than normal, but I, I don't want to continue and end up at like an hour 10 minutes every time so these will be my shorter parts the game's improved a little bit maybe but it's still have many faults I'm having trouble with mostly the camera anyway see you next time